named John Underwood. And John grew up in a very poor area. His family had no money. His father died when he was a baby, and his mother died just a few years later. He was 12 years old, the guy was on his own, he had, he had nothing. And he was really struggling. So he, I don't remember what the story, what kind of job it was, but some job that he had to go around house to house to try and sell things, and he was explaining to people that he's trying to pay for his school. And the story told is that he had literally one dime in his pocket, and that was it. And he was visibly hungry, very skinny, and he went to this one lady's house and asked, when he went there, he was desperate, and he asked, may I please have a glass of water? And he got it in his mind that he was going to ask for food. But when she opened the door, it was a pretty lady, and she just, he just asked for water instead. I don't know why it's really relevant to the story. But he asked for water. She recognized the fact that he obviously needed more than water and brought him a glass of milk and a snack. And that was it. He said, well, how much, what do I owe you for this? And she said, for an act of kindness, I've always been taught there is no charge for an act of kindness. Just pay it forward one day. Years went by, and the lady ended up getting very sick, and she ended up in the hospital, requiring a very dangerous, whatever life-threatening condition it was. She needed a very delicate surgery. So they went from the small town, because there was no proper hospital, to the big city, which was close by where the hospital was, where she was going to have the surgery. So when the team of doctors were looking at the case, Dr. John Underwood was one of the doctors. And he, uh, he immediately went down to the hospital room to see the lady. And he didn't say anything, but he said as soon as he saw her, he recognized Without a doubt, that's who it was. At this stage of the game, she had no insurance, and she was way down on her luck and had nothing. And later on, she told the story that she was worried about how on earth she was going to possibly pay for this, but she had no choice, and she knew she was going to be paying for the rest of her life. End of the story was the lady, when she was treated, she survived, everything was fine. She got a bill from the hospital. The doctor said he wanted to see the bill and prove the bill. She got the bill and it said no charge, paid in full with a glass of milk in 19 whatever. <laughs>